Welcome to Studio 90 here from Carson, California, where behind me the U.S. U23 men's national team is finishing up its second day of training here at the Home Depot Center. This morning, head coach Caleb Porter had all 23 players on the field as the team continues building towards Olympic qualifying in March. One of those players in that group is Joshua Gatt. The forward was part of the U23's first camp of this cycle last November. Injury forced him to withdraw from that squad, and he's relishing the chance to be on the field with the team in 2012. Uh, well, I'm really honored and flattered that uh, I was chosen to be part of the U23 uh, squad uh, to possibly compete in the Olympics. And uh, we have a great team here, a great group of guys, uh, a lot of quality players, and I expect you know every single one of us to push each other to our max to get us ready for the Olympics. Gat had a breakout season in 2011, helping his club Molda to the Norwegian League title. He's hoping to build on that success here in Southern California with the U23s. I'm looking to bring everything we've done last season and me individually as a player into my next season, whether it be with Molda or with the national team. I'm looking to do my best and to become an even better player with my team. And I think that if we all work as hard as we can, we could all accomplish that. It'll be a busy week for the U23s with double days culminating in scrimmages with the men's national team on the 13th and 17th. Then it's down to Costa Rica for two scrimmages there against club sides, all building towards Olympic qualifying in March. You know, I'm really excited to for us as a team to show what we have and, uh, you know, show our gumption and how well we could play as a team. And for us to, you know, be able to play against the U.S. men's national team, the head team is going to be a real test for us, you know, to see where we level out compared to the guys who are playing on the first team and to really prove that we could either belong or we need some more time to fit fit in. And I'm looking forward to those games. I'm looking forward for us as a team to show what we got and for me individually to show what I can do. And as for the Costa Rica games, I'm not sure, don't know very much about the teams, but uh, from what Caleb said, you know, they're great teams and they're really going to test us. And I think that's really important for us going into qualifying to have some really hard games. And I think that they're going to make us better overall. 